Yeah, I just want to come down here and support the guys. You know, uh, I had a great four years here, and I was, I was supported by a lot of other guys that came back and gave me advice and everything along the way. So I just want to come down and be available to the guys and the advice that they need and see if I can help them. All right. The Jets making the playoffs here this year? Yeah, that's, that's our plan. Our plan is to win the Super Bowl. So uh, we're working on that. I, I'm over there talking uh, trash to uh, Mario right now. So we'll see them later on this year. <laughs> All right. We're down here with Tony Baker. Tony, I see the guys out here four and a half years. Do you miss it? Yeah, absolutely. You know, this is my alma mater. Uh, you know, I love everything about this university. And uh, my teammates, it's just good to see them. Running back situation, you and Jamel Eugene gone. What do you think we're going to see from the running backs? I think we've got a great stable of backs. Uh, I think everybody that we have is uh, capable of being a, being a guy. And, uh, you know, we just have to see how it plays out. Your anticipation to the NFL draft, things have been going well for you? Absolutely. Uh, my training in Florida went well. I had a great pro day here, um, went on a couple of visits uh, to Tennessee and to San Diego, and uh, they went well. One of the things as a player you're always proud of are these fans, and they showing up for this game, and how excited is to play for this group of fans? How, what would you like to tell them on your way out? I love the fans. I always have. Um, they always supported the Wolfpack, and uh, I'll always be a part of the Wolfpack. Randy Woodson, Chancellor, welcome. Thanks, Mark. Glad to be here. How excited are you to be here and to celebrate Wolfpack football here with everybody? Uh, it's a wonderful spring game. Great crowd. Uh, we are so proud to be part of the Wolfpack family. People have always wondered when it comes to sports and it comes to athletics, how involved and how excited are you about with athletics here at the university? Well, I, I'm, I'm a huge fan, but you do not want me coaching this team. <laughs> I love college athletics, and I'm great, really proud to be part of this group. What is it about NC State and the athletic programs that make you so proud? This is such a rich tradition. These fans have been loyal to this university for a long time. The Wolfpack Club is great uh, supporters of the university, so we're really pleased to be part of it. Hey, Wood, great to have you back. It's good to be back. Now, when you look across this stadium, does it look anything like you remember it? Oh, no way. <laughs> no, y'all did a lot of great things to the facility. Now, over here to your left, this is Haywood Jeffers. Is that correct? Oh, no doubt. Haywood the third. Does he, does he have the same hands as you? Probably not the same hands, but so he's on opposite side of the ball. So uh, he'll be a defensive back. When you're out here watching these NC State wide receivers, you see these explosive plays. How important is that? to NC State success this coming year and, and for the next couple of years to have success at the wide receiver position. Oh, it's a receiver's game. Uh, yeah, I think as far as the wide receivers, they know they spread it out. So a lot of more wide receivers have the opportunity to put themselves in the process of the offense. Anybody out here looking like Warren Moon? Maybe Mike Glennon be able to way he throws the football? Well, uh, I know uh, Warren wouldn't like that, but <laughs> I think you got some pretty good quarterbacks here and Coach O'Brien. No, he's got a good thing going here. It's turned into a wonderful thing. It gets better each and every year, and that's what our goal is, to be better each and every year as a football team, and certainly our spring game gets better each and every year. So we got to do our part, and we got to be much better in the fall, and that's what uh, we'll direct all our efforts from this day forward to first game against Western Carolina. This is the last impression that these fans will have and the players for the most part will have going into August. There's a lot that has to happen between now and then, a lot of preparation. You excited about what could possibly happen as you go into next season? Yeah, certainly. I think the most important thing is we got to get some guys healthy and get them back on the field for us. But, you know, some guys had some chance to play, make some plays today and step up, and, and they did. So that's good for us. And I know you won one last time to tell these fans how much you appreciated what they did today. Oh, no, they're wonderful. They're, they're in any question. We have the best fans in the state, hands down. Year in, year out, they prove it. They don't have to prove anything anymore. All right, Coach O'Brien, thanks so much. Best of luck this offseason. Thank you. All right, there he is, Coach.